In this video, I'm going to introduce briefly of the bibliometric mapping of science and also an example of how to create a network map on VosViewer developed by the Leiden University of Netherlands. So what is bibliometric mapping of science? The word bibliometric refers to a statistical analysis of books, articles or other publications. That sounds familiar, right? Because whenever you want to conduct a new research, you have to look at the literature review in order to get a good understanding of the previous works. And bibliometric mapping allows you to represent the data of scientific literature visually, as you can see on this map, clearly shown the link between keywords, word or later on, author, etc. The bibliometric visualization approach makes it possible to analyze large amounts of literature, so you can review as many documents as you want. The main aim of the bibliometric mapping of science is to provide an overview of the structure of the scientific literature, so you can identify the main research area within a scientific field. And you can also see how the areas relate to each other and of course to get insight into the size of the different areas. In order to perform a bibliometric analysis, the first stage is to design the best data source that fits with the scientific coverage of your research area. There are many sources of database, but not all of them provide information that allows easily performing bibliometric analysis. And here are some good ones. Web of Science and Scopus. The most common, right? By using bibliometric analysis, these datasets will form different type of maps. It could be the citation networks. It could be the authorship network of authors and organization. It could be the co-citation network or coupling network or co-occurrent network of terms. There are many tools has been developed for bibliometric analysis. The SIDNet Explorer in 2014, the SCI Mat in 2016, the SCI2 in 2018, and Voss Viewer in 2019. Both can be run on Windows, OS X, and Linux operating systems. For today, I'm going to show you an example of how to create a simple network map of term on Voss Viewer with exported data from Scopus. First of all, you need to go to the vosviewer.com to download the software. Here you can see the manual uh, of the software as well. Choose the option of downloading and open vosviewer on your window or your Mac. Okay, let's go to the Scopus. Um, my example is to find articles with the word coronavirus. You can type another keyword which is suitable with the purpose of your research and change the time range of the document. I'm here to choose the 2021, 2021 and only seven days ago. I've got 1755 document results, but I'm going to do some refined for example, like open access only, article only, and English only. Over 900 document results left. I have to download this. And then export to your computer. Open Vast Viewer, create the second one. Scopus and choose the file that you just exported from the Scopus. This will take a second. Sometimes it might take a long time if there's many articles. 
Okay, there are many types that you can choose. I choose here is color current and all the key was only full counting. Here is um, the function for duplicate removal we can talk about later. Choose the minimum of a current. That depends on you. Next, here is the list of all the keywords that are going to re represent in the network map. Okay. As you can see on the map, over 900 articles and the COVID-19, the coronavirus, the SARS-CoV-2 are most mentioned keywords. You can change the type of the network map as well. And you can also see the link strength of the two keywords. Like COVID-19 and social distancing is very close to each other with a very strong link strength. So let's come back with the duplicate removal function of Vosviva. Okay, let's go on to the list of keywords again. As you can see that there are many words with the same meaning like vaccination and vaccine and we need to remove them. Export all the keywords. You save it in, in text format. Open Excel or Google Sheet and upload the data. We have the ID, the keyword, your current and the total link strength. We delete all the columns which is not necessary for the thesaurus functions. Okay, so now we find the duplicates and remove them. You name the first column label and the second column replaced by Save the file and download in the CSV format Ok, now open the VAS viewer and upload the thesaurus file you just created Finally, I have a map again after remove all the duplicates. 